On the first day of social vision, we were welcomed by SUSS and the Provost. There were also sharings by multiple experts that highlighted the various mechanisms that make people vulnerable to the dangers of the cyberspace. This really set the stage for the tone of the forum moving forward. Cyber safety is one of the biggest issues confronting the world today. One of the biggest problems in tackling cyber safety is the lack of awareness. This is why a forum like Sociovation is a wonderful opportunity to not only raise awareness about this issue, but also to channel the energy of the youth to tackle these problems. I really liked their amazing scam race, and it was the first time I got to explore many different parts of the Singapore. The Amazing Scam Race was very eyes-opening. We got to see a lot of famous places in Singapore like the Hong Lim Park, the Boatway, the Victoria Memorial Hall and the Malayan. At each station, we played engaging games that required us to crack some puzzles. Some of the games taught me about the history of the sites we were visiting and some of the games taught me to be alert against the misuse of online technology. I felt the workshops conducted by the various tech companies were really intriguing. Companies like TikTok and Twitter really gave us an inside look on how such tech companies handle the issue of internet misuse. I believe the SIP Socialization Forum 2022 allow us to think about the pro and con and how we can together make the internet a better place. The nature of SGEC's business is steeped in the entertainment of the younger crowd, so people like the students themselves. So it's been an enlightening experience to hear firsthand what the students feel about these issues. At the end of the day, these students make out a huge portion of our target audience and who we want to speak to. So it's important that we safeguard their interests as well. One memorable moment from the Air Ember workshops was a game where we attempted to sieve out paper clips from a bowl of rice while one of our team members had their eyes closed. We then had to guide that member into taking out the most number of paper clips. This game really taught us the importance of teamwork and collaborating for our final project at the end of this forum. The instructor really developed a close relationship with each of us participants. They show us how to apply the frameworks into our individual social media campaigns. They also hosted many games and activity that created a very comfortable environment for us to feel safe to share our ideas. One of the interesting things that we did was perform street interviews to validate our campaign insights. Having these interactions with real day-to-day -day people and knowing their thoughts was valuable for us in gaining real perspectives with regards to the issue of internet misuse. The cultural trail was definitely a big highlight for me. We were able to visit the Gyeongbaru market and also got to experience a lot of great local cuisines. And from there we ventured all around the neighborhood and had activities that taught us a lot more about the place and its heritage. For me, two standout activities were playing the chapte and the hilarious attempts at the, pop, the popular local national day dance. Um, these two activities were really fun and having the opportunity to do it with my groupmates really strengthened our bonds through the victories and our mutual embarrassments. And when I first arrived, I was really worried about the new environment and all the different arrangements like accommodations and logistics but the friends I met here, both participants and the student leaders, really made the journey a smooth one and made me feel really comfortable throughout socialization. I definitely feel like the bonds that I made here within this program with all of my friends from different countries and nationalities will last a long time. And I'm truly grateful for SUSS and Tomasic Foundation for bringing us all together. The connection I made here with my new international friends have been surprisingly deep. And I do believe that, um, even we leave, we will still remain friends. So thank you SUSS and Temasak Foundation for making socialization possible. I definitely think that other partners should also hop on board socialization 
I think it's important for not just content publishers like SGAC, but also brands to begin taking these issues into account and attempting to make sense of these for their target audiences. It will also help them better connect and resonate with brands. I was amazed at how culturally diverse Singapore is and it made me appreciate more our differences in culture. I think that platforms like Socialvation is very important as it allows us to make a difference in our countries and at the same time, it widens our perspectives on the similar issues faced across ASEAN. This strengthens our sense of collaboration and unity to combat the social issue of internet misuse together. <laughs>